Now, another key to erasing global hunger is improving farming techniques in Uganda. One engineering student hopes his work with an unmanned aerial vehicle or drones will help plantations be more effective. Leon Sayanki has more. Ono Koyanga is aiming for the skies. The 24-year-old engineering student is developing an agro drone. I needed to first understand the, the physics eh, behind the drone, eh, the Archimedes principle, how you create pressure difference and then the object lifts off and all those kind of things. And after understanding those things, um, I needed to know the electronics, what kind of components that I need. And then from there, I was able to have an idea of what components I'm going to use to build a drone. Kolyanga's gadget weighs under two kilograms. With a remote control, it can fly at a height of 100 meters for about 15 minutes. Still undergoing testing, Kolyanga hopes the device will one day be helpful to farmers in Uganda. We mainly look at two things. First of all, being able to just look at just eyes in the sky, and then also we look at um, performing an activity. And that is, um, for now, what we can achieve is um, spraying, spraying the crops, yeah, and then also... So, you are going to see that probably farmers are getting more accurate data. So you will have um, live feed on how your crops are doing, and in that way, you can tell what exactly your crops need. Do they need more water? Uh, do they need less water? How are they doing in terms of, is the soil really treating them well? Once Emmanuel's drone is ready to market, it will have to be approved by Uganda's Aviation Authority. And then the sky is the limit. CCTV, Kampala, Uganda.